show you this before I go to bed tonight. I was on a form site and they were telling me that the Christie projector that I showed off in one of the demonstrations has a damaged lamp. For a minute, I'm thinking it's maybe, I don't know why I thought it was DLP mirrors, but they're not, uh, there's no DLP mirrors and this is LCD. So, they're telling me that the lamp is damaged. That's why I'm getting that discoloration um, from the projector. So I had to go on to uh, a form site and a fellow uh, navigated me through trying to figure out where the lamp was at on the projector because I couldn't find it for Jack. Now I found out already how to change out the lenses, but we decided I want to do a ultra short the lens set up in here it has an area where I can disconnect here and I can get access to my lens if I decide I want to change it out for a different lens so all the power cables are right there for automatic there's the lens I'm going to change it right from there so that makes it easier so that way I don't have to take the whole thing apart trying to get access to the lens so the lamps are actually pretty cheap the lamps are going to cost me around $85, so that's not bad. You have to go through the filter in order to get to the lamp. So the filter looks good. I think it's pretty clean, so it's not wrong with the filter. That's good. I should get the filter in there correctly. It's supposed to go into this little area right here. this thing up. Up there around bird. There we go. So that's the filter. That's good. I'm going to add the filters. Don't have any problem. This is the housing. Alright, so let's see what we got to do to get this baby out of here. <sighs> I know I'm not going to remove that entire cage to get that out of here because that would be a nightmare. But that shouldn't be it. We don't have any screws in there. Nothing's locking in place. There we go. Now, can I tell you that when you buy a projector and they tell you that it's a 15,000 lumen projector, this is a lens, this is a lamp for a 6,500 lumen projector. You see the size of that thing? It's big. It's really freaking big. There's no way in the world that a projector like this would be virtually impossible. That's the lens of a 6500 lumen projector. This is a projector claiming to have 15,000 lumens. Do you see the size of my lamp? How big it is, there's no way in the world that that projector is 1,500 lumens. So that was easy to take in and take out. Okay, cool. So I'm just going to order my new one for tomorrow. Because I was telling that I don't use the projector because something's damaged on it. And it cuts off and everything. And the guy, he basically works with Chrissy projectors. So he's saying that you have a discoloration. I said, yeah, discoloration on the... Um, on, when the projector when it goes off he said your lamp is damaged so that's what we got to do we got to replace the lamp so that's what we're doing tomorrow ordering one from amazon amazon has them for uh 65 65 to 85 dollars so that's the one to amazon to get one filters are clean okay that's perfect all right but just so you know that no there is no way in the world that anytime I see a projector claiming to be 20,000, you know how big a, a, lamp, a lamp is for a 20,000 lumen projector, they are freaking huge. So there's no way in the world you find a projector like this claiming to be uh, 20,000, 7,000, 5,000. That's a lie. This is how big your lamps are going to be. They're freaking huge. 
All right, well, that's it. I got to do uh, projector repair this week. So we're replacing the lamps for those two projectors. And the one in the back is good, but the one in front needs to be changed out. I already put a new lamp in this one, so it's good. I want to put a new lamp in this one. This one definitely needs a lamp because this one blew out on me. That needs a new lamp. And let me see. The 505, the Chrissy over here, I think I'm going to buy a backup lamp for that. Other than that, I don't think we have to buy anything else. I'm curious. What kind of lamp does this thing take anyway? And where is the lamp? That's something to figure out. Knockoff projectors, where the freak are your lamps? There's no compartment on here. It's a filter right there. I guess we'd have to take the whole thing apart in order to get to the lamp, because there's no compartment on here for the lamp. Now, this one right here, portable, right here, the Sony's right here, the lamp compartment is right there. Got all these fake knockoff projectors, the lamp compartment. Okay, well, that's it for me. I'm going to have my 6500 lumen projector up and operational. I had no idea what was wrong with it because I seen like this yellowish, not yellowish, but purple kind of display going across my um, screen and I'm thinking like it can't be, it's not DOP. DOP projectors may have damaged mirrors and there's no damaged mirrors in there. So since there's no damaged mirrors and it's an LCD projector, that means that it's definitely coming down to the lens and I had several people in double form sites were telling me that it was the, it's the, um, it's not the lens, it's the, uh, the lamp having the issue. The lamp's cheap. I'm only going to pay about, about 65 80 bucks for it. And that's it. And I'll have my 65 back online and I'll be able to play around that bad boy. That projector is really freaking powerful. So I can't wait to get that set up. I think I'm going to do some projector shopping next week. My collection, I like it, but I want more projectors now. I actually tell you the truth, I'm going to get two projectors that I got my eye on. I want a CRT projector and I want a um a 35 millimeter projector for old fashioned movies with the reel to reel. That's what I'm getting next. Alright, well that's basically all I have to show right there. Got my food ready. About to fire up my screen. Me and the cat gonna sit down, relax and watch the movies. And I'll just put that out there because I didn't see one demonstration on a lamp for a Chrissy projector at all. So I thought I'd do the video, so that way, if anyone else gets that projector, you know exactly how to get access to the lamp and how to install in it, because they don't have any videos on it at all whatsoever. All right, with that being said, I hope you enjoyed. Got to go, and God bless.